My name is Christina Landalt. I've been at Phillips Academy uh, for 12 years now. I was here as a student as well and then went to study film music at USC. And so when I came back here, it was one of the first things that I wanted to bring back as an elective. So now we offer film scoring uh, for the 10th year um, as a 300 level elective, which means that anybody who's taken the intro to music class can take it. One of my favorite concepts to teach in film music is the idea of perspective. So in every film that's ever created, the directors and the writers have to make decisions about whether the audience is going to know what's coming or if they're going to keep them in the dark. The film scorer needs to know this because either the music is going to give away what's coming or it's going to leave it as a surprise. Um, I like teaching this to my young film composers because they need to be thinking about why they have music in there and what they're trying to tell the audience uh, in order to manage the scene the way that the director or the writer wants. I took one music for a period of time to create this very clear separation between um, Batman and the Joker. I want the audience to know exactly like what's happening next. And then, so when Batman appears, I changed from minor key and now it changed to, I believe, A major key here. So to indicate that Batman is here to save the day. But then I also don't want to make it completely cheerful because Batman's Batman after all. He's not like this really, really nice like guy who's like Superman saves the day. So I want to make sure it's still kind of dark. I think that my favorite thing about doing this project is I can kind of use my creativity to impose my vision of what um, this scene is supposed to feel like. Because in, mu like in films, um, it's often like director or like whoever composed the music will like have this vision of like what they think like you should feel when you watch something and then when you watch that thing you listen to the music in the back of your head and like you, you get scared or you get excited or whatever and then it's really like it controls your emotions and then I really like how like I this time I have the authority to control what I think this thing should be like and I think that's like the most fun part about this. <laughs>